Welcome back for some more Death Must Die. And believe it or not, I've never actually beaten the game with Averon. I've probably only done one or two runs ever with this character right at the start of the game. And we're going to go in and see what we can do. We've got kind of a high HP build. As you can see, we've got 161 HP. We are playing on Darkness 30, so it'd be kind of funny to get my first win ever with this character on Darkness 30. I think our armor piece is giving us an extra 100 health. One of our pieces of gears, our, our sword, is giving us plus 100 life. What is a man? This man has a, an extra 100 HP. And hopefully it pays off. This man has a dragon as well. Um, I don't know what I want. Do I want her? I guess I should. I don't think I want that stuff right now. Um, I'm going to take the... I'll take the inner piece, although I think inner piece is going to maybe be a little bit... Hmm. I definitely want Consecration because we have so much HP. It just makes sense. But yeah, inner piece is going to look like it's not doing anything. But it, it will be. It just won't look like much. Do I want you? Um, I would like to get I would like to get more with mayhem and just get my damn my attack damage off the charts if possible. Okay, this is fine. I'm going to take the crit chance. Dragon's gonna help a ton early game. Some temporary passive experience. Because I don't have any passive experience gain in this build, and I feel like that's kind of been the thing I've always leaned on. So I'm curious to see if I can do anything. I'm not taking you right now. This was worth it. Well, I guess at this point I have to do it. You know what? I could do this. Vengeful Strike. Give me the fire attack. I don't know if I've ever really used it. But plus 36% attack. Why not? Now if we could get Mort with Mayhem, maybe we can get ourselves hitting for some pretty chunky numbers. It always feels good early, and then the wheels fall off quickly. I'm struggling to beat this thing with Maris on Darkness 30. If you've watched any of my recent videos, I've Having a, having a really hard time. Okay, so we could go for gem high, which could be really nice. It's not going to get crazy because we don't have his attack. We have the flaming attack, but this is interesting. I'm going to take him. This is interesting. Uh, going fire, I'm justice. I've never done this combo that I can recall. I don't go in with like a full on, not yet anyway, I will eventually, but I, I don't go in with a full on like this is exactly how I want to run the build unless it's like a challenge type run. I like to just kind of wing it sometimes. Armor, oh boy, this could get really, this could get good. Like what's our armor at? 44% damage reduction and we have that much HP. As long as I'm not getting hit too much, we might be okay. Oh, do it. I, 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 maybe I'll just lean heavily on the attack. See if we can have some fun with this. I don't even know why I'm staying here. I need more shrines. There's, I was gonna, I was like, oh, I'll stay here for the first boss, but no in here for four minutes that's crazy that's too much sacrificing on uh on shrines i hear a garbage man inside i don't know if you're able to hear that in the recording but <laughs> it's garbage day where i live 
And thank you to everybody that's been subscribing to the channel. Appreciate it. If you want to see more Death Must Die and other awesome roguelikes, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Helps a ton, and it's free. Let's go with Reprisal. Big, big Reprisal fan. Yeah, I'm not gonna rob that grave anyway. What am I doing? I don't have I don't have any inventory space at all. So unless someone drops a unique that looks very, very interesting, I'm not picking up stuff. And I've got tons of money too, so it's not like I'm losing out on the money that bad. I think most most people that pl have played, if you played probably like 30 hours on the game, you're probably sitting on top of a ton of gear and money by now. <laughs> One thing I wonder, and like I do wonder like different things, is like would it be better if we did if they didn't bind gear? I'll take more armor. Right, then you would be able to then then you wouldn't have to have specific gear sets for each character kind of thing. Might make it a little bit better. I think it would make it better for me anyway. So I think one of the one of the reasons I haven't ran Avern much is because I've just you know, I like Scatty, so I've just been running that character. We'll take Combust. Combust is nice. A little bit of pushback. And they're so similar. Scatty and, and Avron are just very, very similar. All the stats. But I think I think I've only got two achievements so far for Avaron because I just don't run run them. Okay. Oh. Ooh. Yes. Our stats are looking good. Not only do we have 47% damage reduction and 161 HP, we have a 22% chance to evade attacks. I, if I, I, I better not blow this. I better not blow this. But if anybody can, it's Tom. It'd be fun to do a run where you just, all you focus is your damage on your attack. Just to see, like, the crazy number you can get. Um, This could be worth, but we're going to take the gem high. Because gem high is just still very, very strong. I've mentioned that too. Like, I feel like for me anyway, like, I'm not the best player, right? I feel like for me, having Gem High and Bloodlust is almost a must. I'm gonna definitely gonna get cursed, right? Gifted? What does that even give you? Is that the plus full area? I think that's probably the second time I've been gifted. We'll take it. Because that's a big, big amount of pull area to have added more inner peace. I believe. Yeah, I think we will do a run uh, soon here where I just, where I focus nothing but attack damage. Probably a Krant run. Go crazy attack damage and that's it. Front where the armor converts to uh, damage, and then take have to take mayhem. Ooh, that hurt. We are we are chunking this guy down quick.
Not bad. Considering we don't have many spells in the build yet, we're doing some chunky damage. And it's okay that they're hitting me because I've still got all the health. One down. Okay, there we go. Um, I need to take Consecration. Have it in the build. More survivability. A little bit more damage. Over for you. There we go. More armor. Oh, hi. Ooh, hello. I haven't gotten this since it's been buffed. Did they nerf it again? <laughs> I feel like they nerfed it. I thought, it, no, no, that's right. It used to be 0 .004 and it was really bad or it felt really bad. Now it's significantly stronger. Take. Now we'll level. Now we need some things that are going to do... We need more uh, things that are going to do instances of damage for us. That's all we need. We just need a couple things that will do a little bit more... Uh, Damage for us. Force with this could be good, right? Pulling in gems. Because that's all instances of damage. Wow. Um, more experience. This could also be really strong, too. I'm going to take the... Hmm. I'm actually going to take the Alteration Ritual. Take the freebies. Take the 45 minute... For, or 45 minute... 45 second freebies. Yeah, give me that. I think I might be one of the few people that, like, really, really likes Alteration Ritual. I'm a fan. You get the right freebie at the right time, it's, it's a game changer. And that duration is really nice. Okay, here we go. Um, Trail of Fire could be good. We'll take the Breath of Fire this time, but yeah, we need... I think Trail of Fire would be really nice. We're definitely leveling up quicker now, for sure. Like, way faster. Um, More Consecration. Should use these rerolls, too. Trying to get, like, uh, roll for higher rarity stuff. No point in no point in dying with a reroll in my pocket. Imagine getting Pandemonium at this point. That would be pretty sick. Take that. Yeah, now I've got my mindset. Like, if we can get Pandemonium, that would be really good. They changed it so that you can't get it right away. That, that's, that was a nice little uh, bug fix. Evasion. What's our evasion? Our 32% chance to evade now on our, on our tanky boy. Oh, yeah. Lots of leveling. If you had passive experience gain as well, like you, you would be off the charts with this thing. I love your Spell damage increased meteor shower. I'm taking that. Give me, give me more, more things to do damage. 
I'd love to increase the, the spell damage, but uh, more instances of damage, please. Getting shurikens is gonna is gonna help level up. Be mindful of. Yeah, so I'm gonna re-roll again. I'm using my rolls, hoping for something crazy. Ah, ha, 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 let's go. Getting that pandemonium is huge. Normally, I'm not a huge fan of, like, taking a, um, a level upgrade, right? Or a rarity upgrade. But that, upping everything that you've got at this stage, is huge. Here come some levels. Still don't have a dash. Spell durations increased. Sure. Imagine getting if we can get um, taste of time as well would be crazy. Dash leaves a trail of fire. I'm tempted to take that. Gonna do it. And we still don't have incineration. I think we're enemies leave fire. More alteration ritual. So now we get a free thing for over a minute every time we level. My gifts are There's flare. That could be useful. Oh yeah, this is a win. This is a win. Wow, I might, I might actually really like fire. I was under underrating fire. I think. Maybe just the right combo. Also, having, <laughs> having the extra XP for, uh, for the legendary is huge. Combined with Alteration Ritual and all the freebies. Oh, look at that armor. What's our armor at? 59% reduction. At this point, I don't think I'm going to worry about that. Or am I? Yeah, you know what? Fine, I will. I'll take it. I'll take the experiences at this point. 19% more. Let's get some more, more levels. It might help us get an extra level or two. What a run so far. Now, how quickly do we take out this Necro? I imagine it's going to take a little bit of work. Because I don't have... Um, a lot that's gonna hit him, I'm gonna have to like get in his face. Kinda. Right? Like that's that's a bit riskier. When everything's kind of built around your when you're built around your attack, that's where the necro's a bit tough, right? Yeah, like I'm not killing him. Um, 10% well, on my life is actually huge. <laughs> I have almost 200 HP. Got 
Come here. Put this wall down. I'm coming for you. Where'd he go? Yeah, so clearly our damage is still not, like, crazy. Um, let's go with more inner peace. A little bit more survivability. He's almost done. But we're gonna need some more things that do damage on their own because I'm just not hitting hard enough. And I don't want to be standing face to face with Dracula like that. Um gonna reroll. You know what? I could take this. I'm gonna take this. I'll take the time field. Kind of useful. These guys got nothing. More levels, please. Still not level 30, which is crazy. Uh, all minions of death are judged unworthy. That doesn't leave XP behind, though, does it? Does that leave XP behind? I feel like it just kills them and doesn't drop XP. At this stage of the game, it might not be worth taking. I don't know if it does. I'm actually thinking I might pass that up. Um... I'm not worried about I'm not worried about getting hit. Does it kill them all and leave XP? Well I'll take it, screw it. No, I don't think it does. Okay, that's not great. Yeah, that wasn't a good idea. I haven't seen that one very often, so I wasn't sure, but I don't think that's a good choice. Um more flare. Unimpeded Learner's Ring of Collection. I think we win this, but it's just going to be a bit grindy at the end. That's my my thinking. Summer is here. We can get our damage going. Um, Fire Dragon? Yes, please. Holy crap. I've never gotten the Fire Dragon. And we have two dragons. That's huge. Well, maybe it does drop XP. That's no point right now. Minute 26. So we get two minutes. We get a level between now and when Dracula comes out. We're going to have the freebie roll and all the fights going on and we can get a couple freebies this right now we have the the orbs no no I don't I don't, I don't know it's hard to tell if the drops XP let me know in the comments if it does I I can't really tell while I'm playing Time's out. um divine shield just because give me a freebie hit every so often I'd like one more level before before uh, Dracula comes. That would be cool.
just insane. It's so cool having multiple dragons flying around. If only this was a summon build. I could go health, but I'm going to go evasion. Our evasion is 43% chance to evade. That's pretty good. Ooh. Could go armor. I'm gonna take the attack damage. I'm, I'm tired of. I, I need. I need more damage. I don't want to be fighting Dracula for a half hour. I don't think that drops XP. Oh well. We're gonna get a level out of this. Oh yeah. I see you are Let's take the consecration more damage on return. I think we're going to level up one more time during the Dracula fight actually. More inner peace. Okay, here we go. This is it. Do we get our first ever win on Avarin? I mean, it's hard to believe that we won't. I'm fighting my dragon because I'm not used to having the fire dragon. Did he fire those multiple times? I feel like he did. Oh yeah, he's totally firing those off a lot, aren't they? Doesn't matter. More luck. Oh god, I'm getting beat up by these dudes. Maybe I do lose. Ah, we're not losing this. Never. I refuse to, to let you kill me. He's not even halfway dead. No! He's almost halfway dead. Evasions. All the evasions, please. Oh, God. More luck. Did you stop? <laughs> He's firing those things off like crazy. Another level? Hey, give us something strong. Um, more smite. It's halfway. Halfway dead. Over halfway dead. It's a fight, though. Definitely a... Definitely a big fight. More chunks of health down. You gonna get another level here? Be pretty sick. I 
think we have all that evasion. This is this is actually a really fun uh, battle with him. No. There goes all of his minions again. The judgments actually that that saved me there a little bit. And we did it. We beat it for the first time with Avaron. And it was, uh, it wasn't too bad. He was beating me up, but I mean, all the evasion, all the armor, all the health, holy crap. Two dragons. What, what, uh, carried us? My attack actually did a decent amount of damage. That's not bad. Fire dragon at the, oh my god. It did a ton of damage, and we got that late. Wow, 362,000 damage, that's crazy. So we should unlock another sign, I believe that was my first ever win on that character. Yeah, there we go, sign of the guardian, sign of the disciple, a couple more things. So I want to look at that before I end the video. What are those things? Uh, you gain 18 armor, oh that's kind of nice. All blessings you are offered are at least adept. For adept rarity bonuses, convert to expert rarity bonuses. At a 100%... Oh, that's interesting. So you could get some really cool stuff. Neat. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Catch you on the next one. Have a fantastic day.